Well, the Provost Humphrey Law Firm in Beaumont has filed a class action lawsuit against Target. KFTM's Jennifer Gordy explains the goal of the lawsuit and why the law firm says the data breach made banks a victim as well as consumers. The lawsuit claims banks, as well as savings and loans, may have lost hundreds of millions of dollars. Attorney Michael Havard says Community Bank is among the financial institutions affected when hackers got access to the credit, debit, and personal information of Target customers. Community Bank is a $2.5 billion local bank. It has 35 branches, and it, like many other banks, have suffered uh, direct losses as a result of the Target security breach. Havard says they're going after Target to cover what banks spent to help customers. Ultimately, we're seeking uh, damages directly from Target Corporation to reimburse the banks for its losses. And the bank's losses include paying the customers for the fraudulent charges, as well as reissuing millions upon millions of debit and credit cards. Bank Board Chairman Pat Parsons says they're trying to figure out how much Community Bank lost. We're still in the middle of tabulating this. It's not just a piece of plastic. There's a tremendous amount of time and effort and lost sales and lost opportunity costs that, that went into something like this. And literally at this bank in Beaumont, Texas, we had thousands and thousands of cards that had to be replaced. In the end, Target and the banks agree. Customers aren't responsible for the breach or for covering the losses that amount to millions of dollars. In Beaumont, Jennifer Gordy, KFDM 6 News. Now, we've been told Target Corporation does not generally comment on pending, pending rather, litigation.